Hi, I'm on the hunt with the Great Crafters Paper Cut, and we are here at Studio Calico with April. Hi. April. Hi, how are you? I'm great. Thank you. You have such a fun line. Tell us Thank a little you. bit about it. You have three minutes. Go for it. Oh, wow. Three minutes. <laughs> yes. Start the timer. <laughs> I. This is my favorite line of our release, Elementary. We like to do loosely based themes. So clearly, it's a school line, but lots of the patterns could be used for many other things. Here we have our atmosphere paper that has a paintbrushes on the back, but it's oh, a good really cute. basic the stripe. And then we have our penmanship paper with a good tone-on-tone -tone pattern and handwriting practice. Rulers, and this is one of my favorite papers because it was created from a ruler that we found at a flea market. Oh, how fun. An old vintage ruler. And you were saying you just I earlier, love, yeah, it's the all like the infusion. vintage. Yes, yes, it's really exciting. And we've infused more vintage on some of our apples on our nibbles paper. And then this is our library paper that has lots of images from old vintage school primers. Kind of reminds me of Dick and Jane. <laughs> yes, it does. It does. But Very don't, cute. But we can't copy Dick and Jane. No, not so, at all. No, this is not at all. This is Frank. Yes. <laughs> And then this is our composition. The back is like a composition paper, okay. so that it can be cut to make journaling blocks. And our show your work for math oh, with very cool. our report cards on the back from Warren County, Kentucky, which is where Studio Calico is located. Oh, how fun! Yes. Are they your? They wouldn't happen to be yours or your mom's? No, no. But <laughs> my grades were better than the grades on this report card when we when we found it. Okay. Why don't you tell us a little about some yes. of these other great things you have? Also, with our line, we have stickers, journaling cards. The little dog has been very popular. It's adorable. S label stickers that have both labels and words, and then our fabrics, which just are so much fun, and it's great for scrapbookers to take out their aggression on because <laughs> you get to rip it. And I'll put it up to your okay. microphone so you can oh. hear it. Oh, it really does rip. Yes, so you cool. can rip them in different strips. Oh, I love that. Okay. And I'll set this over here. Oh, well, I'd play if we had more time. Yes. And you can make them, and they're self-adhesive, so they kind of fold onto each other. Make little flowers very cool. or oh, strips very across cool. your page. Fun stuff. Okay, and I think you have one more thing you want to show us yes. about your sprays. Absolutely. These are our Mr. Huey sprays. Okay. Mr. Huey is my new boyfriend. <laughs> And <laughs> this is Mr. Huey and Applejack, and it matches the colors of, of the, the line paper. perfectly. So there's, it's a no-brainer. So when I go to scrapbook and make cards, I don't have to think about what mist is going to match what paper. Oh, that's and really great. And my favorite Mr. Huey is the white, which is an opaque white, and it's uh -huh. the only opaque white on the market. Wow, and look that's how opaque really cool. it is. Isn't it gorgeous? That is great. April, this is really wonderful. Thank you.